Yeah, this might be a too OP. Just a little bit OP. What are you doing? They're just traveling. Castle that's not mine, besieged, we don't care. Why would I be giving them money if you peace out now? Makes zero sense. Come on, game. Right, I do need to check this every now and then. Destroy that catapult. There we go. Soldiers! Oh, this one is pretty good. Easy to attack. Let's go get up there and we might see the flags if we're close by to that. We don't get stuck again like this. Come on. Soldier! Bowman! Move! Archer! Forward! Archer! Okay, it looks like uh, the flag disappears. Move. A certain way, f if you move a certain way from it. This one doesn't work Archers. because there's a, a couple of rocks in the Gee, oh my god i hate that Archers. that fucking thing is in a way so we can't make a line Archers. this one at least worked oh come on now don't be shy Archers! 
We want to cover that entrance way on the other side as well. Might take a while. if I'm not careful. Really, game? Really? Funnily enough, when I did a custom battle-like test, or enhanced battle test, and I, when I played as the Ink or Hanzo? Ah, shit. Hanzo? I one shot everything with the bow. Don't know what. Like, what's the difference? Maybe I should check which bow they actually have. Def oh, this definitely is too large to be the one we're using. Or that one we were using. guy stuck up there. Charge! Apparently there is. No, never mind. They got him. Yeah, let's let's see which bow is, are they using. Trusty improved war you let's see how is it actually better than the one we got. Man, I need more yours. Oh, uh, well, we'll get there in time, Adeptus. It takes time. I'm in no hurry. Okay, let's actually check if anyone has a better bow. What's the war you mean? Uh, I don't think they will. Our cav units only have a fucking nag Nagamaki, nothing else. Oh, that's a bit disappointing. Prod war, you mean? Prod war, you mean? No, it doesn't seem like it. Let's show mercy again. We want. I don't want these to rebel instantly, which can and will happen. Look at that. I think they took that back. Maybe. 
See if we can actually save Poros, then I'm gonna try and take that. I'm still not, I'm no longer on the lists. I have too much stuff. I guess you can't get any of the clans here to join you because they are too honorable. Fourteen. That's not gonna be too bad. Unless a bunch of their lords actually just sit in there. Okay, that's not being besieged anymore, so let's besiege this. Well, hey you. Come here. No, this is just single player. Hmm. A worthy opponent. I don't think he's just gonna bypass this. Okay, he's not good. He was going for the castle we just took over there. There is a more online multiplayer version of this, like an MMO, and there's no like AI lords. It's only players on it. If you want to play that, but I do suggest you get like a bunch of people with you or else it's going to be painful. I think it's, uh, yeah, I think it's just called Bannerlord Online. You can find it on ModDB. There should be a server in US, England, Russia, if I remember correctly, and one in Asia. I think it's up to a thousand players. Now imagine that. I guess a good thing about uh, would be if those servers actually reset. So you start off fresh. Or everyone starts off fresh. Otherwise, it, it's not going to be fair if you jump in now. And... Come on, get here. Get here. So they attack me. Come on. Come on, surely you have enough to attack me. Come on. Alright, we can't ditch any of them. Well, we're besieging. And plus there is... Yeah, there is multiplayer. Which is, uh, like, squad-based. Where you can actually, like, control a bunch of, like, units with you. So it's, I think, still 5v5 or 6v6. There's, like, um... I think 50 versus 50? battles, uh, field battles and sieges. And there's like a 5v5 one man, you know. Like a duel thing. The last I checked, I don't think they added anything else. Right, and there are duels. So like one on one. What the hell are you doing? Nothing. Come on, destroy the walls. Okay, there we go. Yo, this one is. Uh, we have the. We do have some decent placements for archers here. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now I am using a bunch of mods, so not everything you see here is uh, in the base game. Archers! 
forward! Arrows! Move! Archers! Archers! Okay, this should be fine. Oh Jesus! That's how you eat a shitload of damage. Just can move the infantry to get ready here. Oh shit! I clicked on the archers. Uh, infantry. Yeah, we want to place them um, like this. Where's the second entrance again? Right there. I think that guy is dead, and so am I. Ooh, these guys actually get the knives. Nice. So these are the umbar consoles. Well, a companion I made into an umbar, uh, well, a umbar console I made into a companion, I guess. No wonder I get killed. I got into a crossfire. That's where usually we want the biggest advantage we can get before we charge in. Oh my god, look at this, look at this weapon, Jesus. Can I lure them out? Doesn't seem like it. Yeah, this is the problem with the Tessogen troops, I guess. Like. Once they can't get in close with the enemies or in melee, there's no way they're gonna hit them. Plus, the air is always gonna block you. Exactly, do we get to the other part of the settlement here? I do love the fact that you can make them turn around as well. Okay, let's see. This way? Do want to open, open the gates again?
Uh oh. Nope. Look at that, they have a bunch more infantry sitting there. This glaive, well, not the glaive, whatever it is, it's not going to be helpful inside. That's, that's, well, neither is this. Ah, uh, let's just attack. Tell the archers to move in, uh, in second wave. Yeah. Don't get me fucking killed, you trebuchet guys. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh, we have a traitor here. And he has a Yari. Kill, get killed by one hit from this thing. Just go through the same fucking bridge. It seems like they did actually. Let me let me check. Looks like it. Oh, that's fucking nice. I just bunch up. It's like it's like total war again. You get your troops stuck in the bridge. Masterwork spot on. Nope. No, I, should, uh, I took it for myself. Shit. Um, beefs. Give away. Now, are the guys that were waiting outside going to attack us? Probably. Or not. The guys that did that, uh, let go, are going to get wrecked there. It might be a good idea to take that army out. Before it forms. Okay, let's see what's next. I guess I need to go up here. Yeah, probably. I'll take these two. Let's see actually their strength. Well, I am going to end this today either way. I think the, the only reason they have so much strength is because they have so many lords. Since they, they are the combined Western and Southern Empire. 
But we did take half of the empire already. Literally. Yeah, look, 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 look at that. They actually managed to defend us. So they might actually take this from the for themselves. But I mean, I've proven uh, many a time I can deal with any army they throw at me at this point. I want to get over here, then I'm going to spam the guys, so let them recruit a little bit. And they don't... They don't need to actually recruit that many. Like 10 or 20 troops each. Then we should be fine. Okay, let's let him go here. I can use a couple of recruits though. Almost all the uh, one troops. Let's see how the big, uh, big, how big the army is besieging that. Check, but I'm pretty sure the next mod we're gonna play wasn't updated further, so it's still 1.7.0, unfortunately. Yeah, that's a decent army. Hmm, are we gonna make it there in time? I do want to jump in, but if the fucking AI troop placement screw me. No, no, this is single player. Otherwise, uh, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be this easy. I want to see if we can actually defend this. Unfortunately, uh, I'm probably gonna get screwed over by the AI like auto placements, which is pretty annoying. Hmm. Yeah, let's start this because uh, the AI is gonna do whatever it wants anyway when it comes to placing the troops. Wait a minute, do they ha actually have anything here? N nope. That's when war came to the rescue. Well, you'll, you'll get the hang of it. Pretty hard on the like beginning horse or beginning mountain of like shitty weapons you get, but later on you can deal with looters with no issues. Uh, obviously, don't play on the hardest difficulty at the start. If you just start playing the game, ease into it all the time. Let's see. I'm kind of thinking of can we play Sarches of. Oh, we can. They can't go up the wall there. Hmm, I see. I guess let's... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so they can come up there. And there. And up the... Okay, up the walls is the problem here. So I guess... Well, of course, the flags disappeared.
Okay, it looks like the flags disappear if you're uh, if you pause the game. So let's move the infantry up there. Place one line there. Place one line here. Let's see what happens. Probably gonna reload this anyway. But I do want to see if it's gonna be a little bit easier if we actually. No, apparently most of the white stuff is gonna stay at walls. Yeah, no problem, man. Good luck. Or actually, might be a better idea just to Place the archers here to shoot at them as they come in. Although if they do come up or get to us here, our guys are gonna get... Why are you going up there? Come on. Yeah, look at that, the, the militia actually have shields. That's so interesting. I didn't notice that before. Ammunition kill all these. <laughs> Soldiers, move. Place them down there. Like that. Do need to stop them from getting to the archers. And this is what I don't like. Uh, the AI just pushes your troops onto the walls no matter what so you can't stop that you can't get them off the walls they're non-stop gonna go garrison the walls or man the walls which is annoying to say the least up there. Archers. Yeah, we're literally gonna lose all our archers because they're gonna get up the walls. No, they do have a bathroom grab. Shit. Didn't notice that. Right, maybe I should go up there, throw rocks at them or something. I 
there are any lock locks left locks left <laughs> oh my god that counts as throwing that's funny I do wish we had more of these. Ah, shit. Is there a arrow thing here? Doesn't look like it. If they went up the ladder in like constant stream, we would have a lot more problems holding on to this. I'm gonna lose a shitload of troops for this. I do want to get a defensive battle in, at least one for a three for a playthrough. how we're doing pretty well we almost killed yeah that's all of them there's not gonna be any more reinforcements for them the archers are just gonna charge in I guess I could place these like there as well a little bit is there a narrow thing yes there is I almost fell off, like a moron. It wouldn't be the first time, like the time I jumped off with a horse. And there was no way to get back in. So much easier when you can actually tell your troops where to stay and them not, well, for the most part, not going around doing stupid stuff. This feels like the warband again. kills I guess that's how I uh, have to defend the sea or get defensive siege battles in just uh, wait for them to attack castle then join in lose a couple of troops every time what what can we do there's no other way because we just sat there they wouldn't have attacked it Unfortunately, those poor peasants. Look at that. It's not peasants. They have Platina guards and the Batanian hero Fion, oh shit, Fion champions. Just 
Okay, then you wonder how ever, er, anything was ever taken, right? Seventy four kills. Forty nine. Okay, so th because this is the last stream, I'm gonna break the game. We're gonna pick two of them. <laughs> oh, a thousand skeleton skill, man. Uh, one, we're gonna make a medic. Unless I guess, give him tactics and uh, athletics, I guess. And this is gonna make my troops invulnerable, basically. The second one, we're gonna make him a steward. I guess we'll give him leadership too. No, no, no. Athletics. Tactics. Oh my god, this is gonna be so fucking stupid. Now you're gonna see in this shit we can get up to with this mod. Or the Distinguished Service. Well enough, they nerfed it, but they made it better, or made it even more OP. Because if you can get so that many kills, you can make break the uh, perks. Look at all those prisoners, man. Wait a minute, they had a thousand men captured? Jesus. Well, we're gonna grab all of them. Sixty-four K experience, noise. Yeah, I have to request entry into the castle I just saved. Oh, yeah, that, that, that I do love that. Now. Surgeon, 890. No, not engineer, quartermaster. Wait a minute. Okay, looks like there's a kind of a hard cap on those, maybe, or I just misclicked. Probably misclicked. Oh, look at that, a thousand athletics. And the Thousand Athletics does what? Each point uh, above 250, you gain one hit point. And as for medicine... Your troops get plus one hit point for every two skill above 200, and we have 890. about tactics increase simulation damage by one percent for every skill above 200 but that's only army commander okay i guess this is only for the party leader so i mean uh, i guess it would work if you make him a commander or a leader next to party.
guess let's go back and dump all the Empire troops. 232 deserted. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's why you don't want to do that. Look at that. 240. Oh, my God. So many militia. And we're still over the limit. What can I dump do? I guess these. Mm, we don't need that many skirmish rushes, to be honest. It looks like those guys beat off whatever was up there. Let's go take these two. No, oh, yeah, look. Oh, that's gonna be so freaking stupid. What's our board capacity? It's still the same, apparently. Wait a minute. Parties, quartermaster. Yeah, look at that. That didn't change much. Oh, right, because the leadership actually increases that. Surgeon. Our guys are going to be in, the, like, they're going to have so much HP, it's not going to be even funny there. We'll never go down. Let's have some fun with that. I do want to bring uh, my companions in, so just so we build the siege equipment faster. I wish we could actually see, like, the amount of hit points you get, or have, actually. I think you can see that somewhere, I'm not sure where. Yeah, 100 out of 100. What about these two? Look at that. Max HP. Max hit points, 880, 850, 107, 171. You can't even tell, uh, see, see for these guys. 105, 107, 224, 105, 111, 111. Mighty blow, which one was that again? Okay, the sword. Okay, look, let's check. Mighty blow, where was that? I think that's athletics. Yeah. Look at that. These perks are so fucking stupid. Like the end game points you get. Or perks. Now, in theory, we should be able to just go through them. Like a hot knife through butter. Let's see how well we do. God, this is the one where we can't place archers anywhere. Archers! 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 Archers!
Archers! Archers! Mm -hmm. Yeah, worth place them. Yeah, we are gonna take some damage from the ballistas, but apart from that, I don't think our guys are gonna die ever. Or maybe we can even take these out. Once they reload, well, they're gonna just keep coming. Infantry, follow your footman. Take over command. Who's trying to shoot me in the ass? What? Can you not stop doing? Okay, there we go. a little bit better. No, no wonder he died. Hey, look at that. Oh my god, you can do this? Come on, fuck off. This is so freaking stupid. You can actually do this. What's up, Armin? Have we come to see the greatest feat of mankind? Firing a bow from a ladder. Zero losses. Then again, uh, well, I don't know why would that matter. Well, since our guys have like a million HP at this point. From the perks, I where did where did they get so many? Oh right, they were at war with surgeons, right? Let's grab them and put them in the garrison. I guess if they have so much HP, they don't actually die. We just uh, can we don't need prisoners here. Yes, we can. Nice. They only go down. Take a, let's see, two. Ah, shit. Of course, you move out of, of out of there, they instantly attack it. But then again, we this is kind of out of the way, so we need to take this. Should have take I should have taken this first, honestly. Apparently, we will still be paying them. All 
Alright, so... Since my guys are gonna be invincible, that doesn't mean the companions are gonna be invincible. Or their parties. So... Destroying the walls might still be a good idea. Let's see. Let's see how well they do on Siege Towers. Even though I know it's gonna suck. Oh, it's this one. Alright, they haven't fought here without the siege tower yet, so let's see how it goes. Yeah, I think the archers took out the guy on the blister. Okay, did they at least fix this yet? Okay, no. You can do it, you can do it. Nah, come on. <laughs> 